Hello and welcome to PolarWave.com. We're going to give you an example of how the spinner works today. You notice we got boiling water. And we'll get that into frame here in just a second. And just under 200 degrees. You can see I'm pulling right out of the pot, right off the stove. 200 degrees, boiling water. Getting kind of hard to hold there. Slip that into the ice, turn on the polar wave spinner, and just place it, get it, get it in line, 45 degree angle. There's an offset groove inside the polar wave inversion cone that keeps it constantly flexing and moving against the ice. You notice it's got the balance and towel on the end of the spinner. And that's it. That's all you got to do. Now I left this video completely untouched for those out there that that actually believe people you can move to the end end of the video and see the final temperature but this only takes two and a half minutes works on cans from two inches to three inches in diameter and all you have to do is 45 degree angle place it in set it. it's got a built-in timer in the spinner depending on what you're trying to cool down if it doesn't have it doesn't come in a can you can place it in the stainless steel cool cup and cool it right down all you have to do to make a little ice cream put a quarter cup of milk to a tablespoon of ice cream mix generally a half cup works best put a little salt in the ice set it for five minutes that's the second setting on the spinner it's got three settings five minutes works best then you undo it and you can look at the other video on the on the website that shows how to make ice cream but this is that's all you got to do you just set it and it goes off automatically this is just two and a half minutes got a little salt on the ice basically salt doubles how fast it will cool but it'll do the same thing in uh, in five minutes without the salt And you see the spinner shut off by itself. See how it grabs hold of the can? I have to actually ask my assistant to hold the camera so I can grab a hold of it. And we'll get the thermometer in here in two and a half minutes. We've gone from 200 degrees all the way down to 30 degrees. And that's the polar wave spinner.